Okay, this video is going to look at simplifying equations uh, with the TI-89 calculator. And this is one of my favorite videos because uh, if there's any proof that the College Board is ignorant of the power of the TI-89 um, for allowing it to be used on the calculator, this would be it. Um, this question, these two questions actually, I'm showing you the first one right now. Um, Across the nation, 56% um, of kids got this first question right, uh, and only 51% of students got the next question. So only about half the students for each one. And both of these can be done on the TA-89 with literally no math. All you do is input the equation, push enter, and the calculator will simplify it for you. So if we look at the first question here, um, it just says for all x, they give you this equation, sine x plus ne sine negative x plus cosine x plus cosine negative x equals, and which one of these choices does it simplify to? Well, let's just plug it in. So sine x, let's do this first. Uh, we have sine, whoops, um, to do this, we'll have sine x plus sine of negative x plus cosine of x plus cosine of negative x. Nothing fancy at all about this. Push it in, push enter, simplifies to 2 cosine x, which is choice D. Um, so right there, no work to be done. Just enter it and just pr key it in and push enter. Easy peasy. Uh, next, next question. Um, here we have another simplification problem. n minus 1 factorial squared divided by n factorial squared simplifies to which one of these uh, equations? Um, we're just going to, instead of putting in n, we're just going to put in x for simplicity here. Let me just clear everything here. Same exact thing, just be careful when you key it in. Two parentheses to open, x minus 1. And now our factorial key um, we can find it in catalog, which will start in alphabetical order. It starts with A. We can just scroll up a little ways until we find the exclamation mark. Right there is our factorial key. Push enter. Um, all of that squared. And we are just dividing that by another x factorial squared. Um, now, if you go to back to catalog, you're already right where you left off at the exclamation mark. Push enter. Be careful with your parentheses. We're squaring that. And it simplifies to 1 over x squared, which is the same as 1 over n squared. So the answer would be choice B. Couldn't be any easier.